So, I feel like this honestly really has to be said. And I had this on my mind for a while. I had this problem going on with me and my friends. Well, I honestly would like love to call them my friends, but I feel like there is just a lot of separation going on between me and them and my inclusion to them and uh, their inclusion to me. I, I'm going to get straight to the point. I feel like most of my friendships are really toxic. I'm not saying anybody. I'm just going to explain what's going on in my mind right now and hopefully uh, find a way to fix it and get rid of this empty feeling that I'm always having and this uh, this anger that's dwelled inside me for a while and hopefully like I said get this all resolved within time or maybe not maybe I should do something maybe I should talk to them about how I feel or I feel like I should just let them go like with a couple of other my other my friendships that I had and and just completely let them let them go and be on their own merry way and everything um this most of the times I've been with my friends we were all having fun we had a lot of memories going together and it was just the blast I thought of them as my family and everything but recently I got back with one of my friends that I um, that I just completely said that I didn't want to be friends because of this whole entire thing but this stuff happened again and I I'm gonna be honest I don't know how to deal with this anymore like now my other friend uh who is in the same group with me is doing the same thing as what my other friend did and i'm feeling kind of hurt because we were all like bros and everything and i i just i i don't know how to respond with it and and i've been worried about him he most of his tags felt like it was like suicide messages and everything i was so worried sick about him and it's just i i tried talking to him i wanted to talk to him he fucking worried me and i was so fucking worried i i was getting to the point where i thought he was actually going to fucking hurt himself and all of a sudden he just starts talking in the group chat and I, I like I, I I probably spammed on his me messages and he probably like uh, he probably like muted me or something but now most of the times when I'm trying to talk to him on the fucking group chat he's just ignoring me like why what did I do what did I do to you and my inclusion in the group chat is just like now no it's like it, it feels like it doesn't exist like I don't know how to respond to it I don't know how to feel about it it's like an empty confusion in everything my my thought is like maybe time would heal maybe I might have did something wrong or something because I never recall anything that I did anything wrong maybe time will heal it and maybe I I can talk to my friends normally again but i i also have this one feeling i'm just like it's not worth it because i'm just getting the same fucking feeling as what my other friend did to me a year ago and 
I'm I'm just starting to get to that point where I feel like I should leave. I have another friend. Um, I'm not going to say his name, but he's a he's a he's a great friend and everything. I also have a best friend named Jacob. He's always on my streams. He's my uh, he's my admin moderator for YouTube and Twitch. And he he J my friend my best friend Jacob he's he's the he he means the fucking world to me. Like I would die for him. He's he's literally my fucking best friend, bestest friend in the whole fucking world, man. Like I said, I would I I I I worry about my friends. Hell, a lot of times I worry about my best friend Jacob and he, he understands. He still talks to me. He's just He's just, uh, he's limited to when he can communicate with me or anything. Not because of, like, um, his mother or his father or anything. It's just because of where he lives. But, like, with my other friends, like, am I allowed to worry about them? Like, if I'm not, then what am I supposed to do? Hmm? What am I supposed to do? Let you die? Let you hurt yourself? Like... Why am I not allowed to worry? If it's get to the point where it is annoying, it's more... I feel like it's more likely your own fault that you let that happen. Or, like, you... Not, not like, with the problem they're having, but, like, how they act. It feels like it's their fault to how they act and everything. But, I... I'm just the nurse sucker to be like back into a friendship that is completely just nothing to me now or nothing to them like i wanted i was hoping that they would change but it just seems like it's just the same fucking shit all over again i'm i'm getting really worried it's just starting to get to me and I'm not going to lie, when I was away from my friend, I was feeling a lot better. And when I was away from the group, I was feeling a whole shit ton better. Like, I, I just don't know. I'm confused. My, like, it hurts, but I feel like, I feel like my emptiness is at ease. Because then I don't have to worry about them. I, it's just frustrating at this point. It's starting to get worrying. I know this is an animation channel and everything, but I'm not going to lie. It's my channel. I, I'm allowed to do whatever I want with it. Like, I'm, like, animating is my hobby. It's the thing that I really love. But there is also a couple things that I can try to change for the channel like with smuggy talks and a little bit of gaming and i i feel i feel like my channel is uh, a jack of all trades sometimes but i love my channel i love my community i love everything about it i want i wanted to vent out this little problem that i've been having and hopefully get it off my chest and hopefully let some people know of my little problem that I'm having because of uh, uploading schedules and everything. I'm, I, I'm kind of, this is all I'm going to say. I'm kind of hurt from this. I want to upload more, but my depression just gets honestly really worse. And... Even during my stream, my heart was feeling heavy and everything. Like, why Why am I back here? Why am I back at this hellhole? Like, what is, what is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Or what is wrong with them? I know there's nothing wrong with me. But just, what's wrong with these people? What is wrong with them in general? It's, it's confusing. 
and knowing that there is also a bunch of controversy that's happening uh, around the animation community now again for I don't know how many times there is it, it sickens me it, it really sickens me that this stuff is happening and it's also affecting my mental state a lot more than it was it it's making it worse. Like. If. Um, so. Here's the thing. I'm not going to say. Uh, what controversy is happening. There is. Something about. Squizzy. The animator. Hyojin. Uh, you might want to just go look it up, look up what the controversy is, and see for yourself. I'm not going to go full deep into it, but that's what is being shitted on on the uh, community because uh, what she did, what she did was wrong. And I, I, feel, I feel really bad about having people like those into the art community and say that it's basically like oh maybe it's satire maybe it's not real maybe it's not this and that and that well if something is said and done they mean it's really what it is i'm i'm tired of having people um defending these people who are very high on the youtube algorithm and everything i I'm tired of these people. People are fucking defending them, and it just gets worse. It gets worse for every community, for the art community, and affects them really badly. It's affect. Well, it. it I. I don't know if I can sh say uh, if it's affecting me badly, but it's affecting also my mental health because this this is wrong. This is really wrong. Yeah, along with the toxic friendships, the art community, I'm I'm completely baffled. I'm completely baffled that these people chose to do one thing and think it's good for them. It's not. I'm tired of these people. I'm tired of toxicity. I'm tired of the defenses. I'm tired about people who try to see the light on this situation or whatever. It, there's no light to see in this situation. This shit happens and it gets worse. It goes to the same thing, same category as the to both toxicity, uh, toxic, toxic friendships, and the art community. Um, I'm part of the art community. I love the art community. I love my friends, I'm part of my friends' life, but there is something wrong when it comes to these things. I'm tired of it. I'm really just fucking tired of it. So, yeah. I just wanted to get this off my chest, get this uh, ball rolling, and hopefully uh, tomorrow I will... Well, tomorrow I will start, like... Working on most of my videos that I'm going to be doing, most of my animations and everything. Like I said, like I promised with the uh, with the post, I am making like voices for like a couple of memes that I posted. I just thought they would be funny. I thought I thought I'd just get a good he he hoo hoo ha ha laughing and everything. So yeah. Um, if you. If you were me, you had a lot more smarts than I would. My, I, I can't really follow my own advice because I, I, I'm, I'm a really dumb person. I'm not going to lie. I'm a really dumb person. But my advice to you, if you were, if you guys are stuck in a very toxic relationship, very toxic, uh, friendship or anything, just get rid of them. Or at least, or at least address that this stuff is happening. 
and all this kind of stuff. Spread the word, everything. Just be yourself, gather your courage, and just be them. Leave them or talk to them. There's, there's only two options, and both options are correct. So, yeah. Anyways, um, that is basically my rant that I wanted to do uh, today. And if I have anything else, if I have anything else to say, I would definitely say it. So, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully, uh, most of you have, like, listened to my problem. If you did, thank you so very much. I am really happy that somebody out there is listening. And, yeah. I hope you have a very good night. Thank you again. Love you all and stay safe. Please be safe. Okay. Bye.